Hello there! My name is Lucas and today I decided to discuss with you guys my plan for year 2023. I know it's already February, so uh, it's a little bit late, but you know, better late than never. And I thought what I can do for my channel in this year, what are, what are my goals and what can I do better than my previous year previous year and here it is uh, first thing i set up some goals which i want to achieve at this year if it is possible uh, first of all uh, i would like to introduce to you more games i'm not sure if those games would be the newest one or just some uh, games from you know the old older older games the older games or uh you know something uh, something you probably would ask and i can look at it and uh, something more uh it's i would like to reach a thousand subscribers and now i got 36 which is not that much but if you imagine 36 people <laughs> in real life it's pretty big group of people so I'm, I'm glad for 36 but you know more is more so uh, I will try to do my best to achieve that goal and uh, and uh, the next goal which is probably the thing that will help me improve my videos and uh, everything and that's the editing skills uh, I got a new pro program uh, which is DaVinci Resolve it's pr pretty new to me and I'm still learning with that but you know I got full-time job and part-time job uh, as a photographer so I got <laughs> not a lot of time uh, free time to learn new things but I would like to learn how to edit in a Da Vinci and you know uh, do better editing skills uh, sorry do better editing and of course um, not just to hit and play uh, you know when I record a game of course I can just hit and play and uh, do nothing else but you know there's nothing Nothing to it, so I would like to make it like uh, if you know the game channel Neeps Neeps Gaming. No, no, what is it called? Let me see. Wait a second. Uh, yeah, Neeps Gaming. Uh, they are pretty cool guys, and I really like them. And I like their editing skills, uh, or just the editing and the story they put into the games. So uh, I think it's amazing and I'm watching them from 2014, uh, 13, I guess. Yeah, yeah. And uh, look at the, their channel. Uh, there is a sad news that one of the, one of their, uh, one of the guys, one of the guys from the group died. Um, I guess it was because of cancer or tumor on brain. So uh, sad news for them. Um, and uh, of course, when I'm <laughs> not, as you can as you can say, I'm not a native English speaker, so uh, it could be pretty hard for me to explain some things when I don't know the words, or you know, uh, I'm, I, I'm not sure if the words are correct. So. It's my goal for next year to be better with my English. So, you know, I, I think that <laughs> this will help me if, if I'm talking to YouTube or to you guys, you know, and try to explain more uh, and, of course, read more in English and, you know, use the language more. It could imp improve my skills at it. So, uh, that's my goals for today's years. And uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> just for the year 2023 and uh, there is more of course and uh, I wrote uh, some games which I'm uh, still planning to play uh, in this year and uh, first of all it's Postscriptum 
Yeah, I heard that the game is dead, or some players on Steam call it dead. So I don't think that's true. I know there was a happening on the background with the dev team that they fired them, and there is no one who is de- developing the game, and the developer uh, tells nothing. It's completely silent, so it looks like that the support for the game is completely dead and the game is still unfinished. And it's a shame because I prepared uh, honest review number two, where I uh, wanted to, you know, uh, make sure that my first honest review is still true or not. Uh, I can still do it, but well, some of those points I made are irrelevant now because well, there is no developer team, so. But I'll try. And uh, of course, my favorite game is Railroads Online. Uh, there was a lot of changes last year. Uh, first of all, uh, Astrogon took a place in it, and it's a game changer, to be honest. They did, they did a lot of things. Uh, they changed the they, sorry. They changed a name. Changed a name of just Railroads Online without the exclamation mark. So uh, it looks nicer and uh, I think that they changed even the logo and they made a competition about um, new maps or new trailer they want to I- introduce. So I, uh, they, made, uh, they made competition where you can uh, sign your map and we, they, ca- they will look at it and uh, if they think that your map is good they will make uh, some videos of your map and it will be in a trailer and you know and you can win some things so i didn't do it for winning some things i was just like i, I want to be part of the competition but sadly um they didn't uh, handle it well to be honest uh, or that's my opinion the next thing is uh, kingdom come deliverance yeah uh, I know it's old game and a lot of players played it and uh, finished it uh, four, five, ten times. But you know, sorry about that. <clears throat> I'm still a little bit ill, so it's been two weeks and I still, I'm still not perfect. And uh, back to Kingdom Come. Uh, I know it's old game. And uh, this month it is a five year anniversary, and uh, the game is still amazing. Uh, I did only two videos, uh, and <laughs> as you can see, uh, there is not a lot of views. I know it's uh, it's just for me. Uh, Rick, I'm just doing it for me the game because I I love it. I love the game, and I want. To, I tried to be part of the team for from Warhorse Studio, but they didn't just they didn't uh, take me uh, uh, for the for the meeting or easy enough. Just they didn't give me the job, so um, I was out <laughs> out of those. Uh, C C. And that's my problem with English. I don't know how to explain it. I just didn't get the job. <laughs> that's it. Uh, and uh, that doesn't mean I, I I can't play the game. So I'm still going to do it. And I'm going to play it by myself. I'm, you, you will see. And uh, there's more games I would like to add. And it is a GTA 5 not playing uh, the, the storyline uh, which i think it's pretty boring but uh, gta 5 with my friends uh it's amazing yeah, i know i know it's old even older than the kingdom come deliverance but you know the multiplayer is still fun and it's still amazing and when you play with the friends it's something it hits different so i'm just gonna try to record something and if it is success i can continue with that uh, i thought of minecraft uh, 
as a lot of guys, I played the Minecraft with again my friends. We created a lot of servers, a lot of maps, and I would like to do just a sneak peek at our old creations and just show it to you guys which what we played or where we had a fun with uh, the Minecraft. So I think it would be it would be nice to show to to the world what we were doing at the time. And uh, another game I thought it would be nice to show is War Thunder. Uh, I played this game since 2012, 13 again. I I don't know. I'm not sure. And uh, yeah, I, I'm not still the best at the game. I didn't play the game a year, maybe two. So uh, I have no idea how the game developed. So it will be new to me. But I just want to show uh, some of my gamer skills, which are not that great. But you know, we can have fun together. So no shame. And the last game I thought of is Heroes and Generals, but um, <laughs> the game is completely dead, uh, or a lot of people think of the game is dead. Um, I played this game a lot, and I remember that when when the game was just only web website game, I, <laughs> I uh, played it on my web browser Mozilla Firefox and you had to download the client and the game opened on the Firefox window and it's pretty, it's pretty old, <laughs> this, <laughs> it was, it was amazing and uh, developers decided to shut down the, sh shut down the game and launch the new game, but uh, uh, I stopped playing the game because it was pay to win and it wasn't fun anymore. You know, I played it with a lot of with a lot of friends and um, they said that it's boring and it's something when you are, when, when finally you got a free time, it's not fun. Not fun playing this game. So uh, I think that the developers did it to themselves. They buried their own game. So, shame on them. And uh, of course, uh, uh, I would like to I would like to say something about uh, more about this channel. Uh, I created a Twitch and Discord server. <laughs> I still don't know how the Twitch works, so I need to read something about it. You know and try to learn and, uh, and then next thing is discord i created for especially for railroads online when i'm playing on the map and you know there is nothing like a text function or you can't communicate with the guys who are who are uh, joining to your server so uh, link is uh, on my main site or information site of this channel and uh, of course there is a, a password to my to my um, server while I'm playing so it should always work and uh, my server name on uh, on uh, railroads is uh, Siler Lucas so you can find me there and I'm playing on my self-made map so I'm having fun <laughs> Okay, uh, I hope you enjoy this video and you know, if you have uh, something on your mind, just write down below, uh, just write down to the comments your thoughts or hates, if you, if you will. And if you have something to add up, just write me. It's okay. Uh, and that's probably it. I, I have nothing, nothing else to say. So have a nice day and goodbye.